Despite moves to increase the supply of baby formula, many families are still feeling the pain of the nationwide shortage. And that's where one local mom comes in. She's helping parents through a project called Formula Hunters. Eyewitness News anchor Siafa Lewis shows us how it works. These are the Robinsons. There's full time working mom Christine, full time working dad Paul, and their three sons Shay, four, Liam, 19 months, and newcomer Brody, who is five months old and drinks formula. I'd say it was probably about a month and a half ago where it started to really become a crunch. And so Christine started thinking. I found the entire supply chain issue somewhat fascinating just simply because of my, my line of work. Christine diagnosed a supply and demand mismatch and employed strategies honed during her career to bring organization and order to the chaos. She formed a Facebook group called Formula Hunters. So the way that it works is it's a form. Three questions. It's what's their Facebook name because we need to be able to contact them. What brand do they use because that is so important. And of course the 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 time, the time horizon. You know, when are you going to run out? And here's the genius part and the angel touch. It circumvents scammers. You can't get scammed if you never send anyone money. So, what if our group was donation only? Wow. And that's what we did. Most of the formula is shipped at the shipper's expense, which, as you might imagine, is quite costly. But today, there was someone close by in need. And for the first time, Christine got to meet someone she was helping in person. I seen it on Facebook. One of my friends were in it. I'm not sure who, but I seen it. And then I've been talking to Christine. And she's amazing. <laughs> it's amazing, I think, what the kindness of strangers has been able to produce. It also begs the question, though, how much longer? You know, you don't need me to tell you how much bad there is out there in the world, but this is a reminder that there is way more good. And Christine Robinson is proof positive of that fact. In Feasterville, Siafa Lewis, CBS3 Eyewitness News.